it's been hard to see because it's lost a lot of snow I know to keep the north side of the rocks on to my left and that way I sort of have a perspective of where stuff is like clearly there's rocks here and it's the north side Amazing swirling clouds, incredibly spectacular. The cloud is breaking up, might get a view. First time for the morning. Magic. That's so beautiful. Stunningly beautiful. First day of skiing for the year. And the snow's already starting to disappear. The clouds almost clearing. I'm heading towards Cleef Hole Hut at the moment. Now Bogon Summit over that direction. Turn gullies down there. Yep. Okay, goes down that direction. Slowly heading towards Hell Gap. This is looking down S Tail Spur. So you can probably tell. You can't see much at the moment skiing. It's this direction. It's just what you call a whiteout. And the cloud comes and goes like now, so you can see a little bit. 
makes it technically challenging skiing. I can't see nothing. I am heading in the West Peak direction, undecided whether I'll continue because uh, it's not much of a view. It's this direction. Contrast to the so you can see, not just white upon white. Like a white out, white upon white, but when you got some contrast, right like now. It's been hard to see because it's lost a lot of snow. I know to keep the north side with the rocks on to my left, and that way I sort of have a perspective of where stuff is. Like clearly, there's rocks here, and it's the north side. Amazing swirling clouds, incredibly spectacular. It's a little bit tricky at the moment, so I'm following it around. But this really has to be it that dips down. Can't be anything else. And that will go down to the West Peak and that'll be Quartz Ridge over that direction. That's why I'm keeping that to the left of the rocks. Because as you can see, it's hard to ski when you've just got white. So if it gives a bit of contrast, at least I know it goes down here. It's soft, the snow at the moment. It's quite soft. I assume it's down here. I'm not looking at the map at the moment, and if not, I'll just turn around. Oh, there's a wedge tail eagle right at me. It has to be. Look at him. Oh, do you see that? It's a wedge tail eagle. Going away, that's the West Peak. So we're going the right direction. I want the Wedge Tail Eagle. I've got my Sony A1 with the 400 mil zoom. And I'm ready for him. Stopped, but he went. He was going the other direction. So let's really hope that he comes around here because this is the spot where they hang about. There, one second. I could hear the crows and then I could see him, but he was going the other direction. There's no way I was going to get this camera, the good camera, out in time. Right, head up the West Peak. Almost to the summit. A bit further to go up there. This is the West Peak summit of Mount Bogon. That's Mike here. One minute it is, one minute it isn't. That's sort of clearing bits. It's time to leave the West Peak. It's quarter past two. I think I have to get back to the staircase spur where my tent is. Up. 
Look at that. This is the way to the summit. It's been like this most of the day, following my ski tracks. So. There's a little bit of a silhouette ahead now, you can see. Eventually, we'll see the summit. It's worth heading back from the West Peak. It takes a while, this, this last hill. I know it's this way, following my tracks, makes it easier. And that's what you call the white out. That's the summit, as you can probably tell. It's still sort of a white out. I guess there's no wedge tail eagles to take photographs of. But it's good to make it back to the summit. I'll slowly head down the staircase, back to my tent, and then pack up. That's the summit. Follow the tracks, make it easy, and the pole line. It's quite sticky at the moment, slow spring snow, a lot of moisture in it. Down the staircase. Down here somewhere. Ooh. Yep. Home sweet home that I had last night. Made for a nice campsite. Now I've got my new sleeping bag. Makes a big difference. Time to head down. I guess the rain's meant to come in tomorrow again.